we will address the question, is it better to intake omega-3, omega-6, or omega-9 fatty acids, or a combination of them? Omega-3s are essential fatty acids, meaning they cannot be synthesized by the human body and must be obtained through diet. They are necessary for bodily functions. Omega-3s have several key functions. They are an integral component of human cell membranes, particularly in the form of DHA, docosahexaenoic acid, which is a crucial component of the cells in the brain and retina. This makes them vital during pregnancy and infancy when the brain is developing. In adulthood, they are important for cognition and eye health. Omega-3s are also precursors to anti-inflammatory molecules called eicosanoids, which include prostaglandins, thromboxines, and leukotrienes. However, they are less inflammatory compared to those synthesized from omega-6. This is why maintaining a balance between omega-6 and omega-3 is crucial. Omega-6 can cause inflammation, while omega-3 can decrease it. Omega-3s are beneficial for cardiovascular health, they reduce the risk of plaque buildup, stroke, and blood clotting. EPA, eicosapentaenoic acid, in particular, can reduce the liver's production of triglycerides by inhibiting enzymes involved in lipogenesis and enhancing beta-oxidation of fatty acids. This results in their entry into the Krebs cycle, producing energy and indirectly decreasing triglyceride levels. EPA is known for its cardiovascular benefits and DHA for brain health. Fish oil, which contains omega-3, is found in fish, nuts, and seeds, such as walnuts, chia seeds, and flax seeds. The upper allowed limit of omega-3 as a supplement is 2 grams per day. In contrast, omega-9s are not essential, as our body can produce them. They have health benefits, including increasing levels of good cholesterol, HDL, and decreasing a bad cholesterol, LDL. They also improve insulin sensitivity and regulate blood sugar levels, aiding in diabetes management. Although omega-9s have anti-inflammatory effects, they are not as potent as omega-3s. Foods like nuts, olive oil, and canola oil contain high amounts of omega-9. Omega-6 is essential but less beneficial, it is found in many products, especially oils. Therefore, a deficiency in omega-6 is rare in the average person. Although omega-6 plays a role in various functions, including as a structural component of cell membranes, it is pro-inflammatory, which is why it is not considered as healthy. According to meta-analyses, omega-3 significantly reduces the risk of cardiovascular disease, improves cognitive function in older adults, and decreases depression, albeit slightly but statistically significantly. Regarding omega-9 fatty acids, they may offer protective effects against diabetes and improve insulin sensitivity. However, studies on omega-9 are not as extensive, primarily because they are non-essential and the body can produce them in sufficient quantities. In the case of omega-6, its effects are more neutral, but a high intake of omega-6 can increase the risk of certain cancers, particularly breast cancer and colorectal cancer. To summarize the comparison of omega fatty acids, omega-3 is the most beneficial, with both EPA and DHA being crucial. Fish oil, which contains both EPA and DHA, is an excellent source. Omega-9 comes in second place due to its non-essential nature but still offers health benefits. The intake of omega-6 as a supplement is not recommended due to its potential adverse effects.